Hey beauties, coming with you with this late wig review on this hair that I purchased from Wow African. Uh, this review is definitely late because I did receive this in November. Okay, so the wig does come in this box that says Wow African right on there. It's really cute. It's a really cute box. The packaging was really cute. Um, and once you open the box, you just see the receipt. That is very important. Their receipt and their return policy is very specific. So before you even touch your hair, and if you get something dramatic like I did, please read the receipt first because they have specific ways to go about your return and your exchanges. So please read your receipt. And then underneath the receipt is the wig. This bomb looking little wig. That's what you find underneath the receipt. And it comes inside of a hairnet that comes inside of a bag and this is what the bag looks like it's pretty lengthy and on the bag it just has a brief description of the wig that you order and it says item number clw35 um hair color silver gray hair length 16 inches which comes right underneath my chest uh yeah right underneath my chest and i'm about Five, five and a half, five, six, pretty tall. So that's good length if you just want a regular size um, wig. Also, the wig came so much prettier. Honestly, like I ordered, I got this in November and now in January, and I've been keeping it inside the bag. I did wear it about six times, and the wig came in like it had like a body weight feel to it i haven't washed it since i haven't really done anything to it but i did straighten it for this wig tutorial just to see if anything would shed and i'm having really minimum shedding like i'm not really having any shedding just a little bit but again i haven't really done much to the wig besides i did tweeze it just to make the parting space look a little bit more realistic now, what I don't like about this parting space is that the lace that they give us isn't deep enough. So you do have to leave out some of your hair if you want it to look super natural. Um, right now, I just literally popped it on my head just to make this video. And I also received this gift. And we'll have a little talk about why I received the gift because it normally doesn't come with it. So I don't want to tell you guys, oh, I got a gift and you guys think that it actually comes with the item. It doesn't. I did have troubles with my purchase, with receiving my purchase. So we'll get into that. So just to clarify, this is a gift. It says it's not an item. It's a gift. Um... Now, let's discuss my issue with this whole Wow African hair company. It was not really, an, well, it is an issue because I was upset about it. So I feel like I just need to be honest because you guys will possibly be buying from them. Um, once I ordered this hair, October 3rd, I didn't receive it till November 15th. That's a long time. Now, I don't order anything online unless I do um, my homework on it, unless I look up reviews and see how other people maintained it. I'm pretty good with maintaining hair. So to me, it was like, I know how to calculate if I want to get the hair or not. Let's just say that. So reading the reviews, everything, everybody was saying that the shipping was pretty quick. And for me to not get my hair like over a month later like come on that made me so mad like it literally made me so mad and the reason why i didn't contact them so soon was because i didn't really plan on wearing my hair until halloween so i did order it on october 3rd or october 4th one of those two days so in the meantime i did kind of forget about it not completely forget about it i was just letting it come at its own pace because October is not till the end, I mean October, Halloween is not till the end of October. So I was like, okay, I have time. So even if it comes a little late, that's fine. Three days before Halloween, I'm like, yo, I was trying to be storm. I was trying to warm people up to this wig because the day after Halloween, I was still going to have this wig on and <laughs> it was still going to be here. 
So I didn't get to do that and I was just like, oh my goodness. And I didn't really reach out to Wild African because it kind of kind of went out went over my head until like November 5th, no November 4th. I gave it a I I said I wanted to wait a whole month since it didn't come on Halloween. I was just like whatever. I'll give it a whole month to see like what's going on. Is it just going to come up or is it just going to not come? So, November 4th, I emailed wowafrican.com and I spoke to a Re Rebecca and she was really nice. The customer service was definitely a good customer service. I would rate that pretty good. I would definitely order from them because I have a lot of a lot of experiences with bad customer service. So, yes, I did like the customer service. Rebecca was really good, so kudos to her. Um, I basically just emailed her like my wig I ordered October 3rd is not here November 4th what's going on so then she explained to me that there was some packaging issue or some issue with the original hair that I ordered this is not the wig that I actually ordered I ordered something a little lighter than this gray but this is fine but she was just saying that the wig that I ordered had some issues so it was a delay on that and if I wanted this one she'd send me she sent me pictures and I looked at it and I was like okay cool and she's like if I want this one she could ship this right over so that's what we did but I still feel like if there was like a tracking problem with my wig I feel like they should have reached out to me sooner and not just prolong it for a whole month so that was the only real con with the wig with the wig shipment and everything but I really do like the wig it's really soft it just really sucks that I'm not going to be wearing it like that like I wanted to wear it so I'll probably bring it back out in the springtime probably wear it a few times now that I have it on my head because every time I wear it I just love it Ugh, I wore it to a Travis Scott concert and it really gave me life I was like who is this i don't know neither <laughs> so yes you guys that concludes my hair review if i do pull this out again or do anything new to it i will wear it and i will probably just tell you guys a little details that i tweaked on it it won't really be a detailed review because this is my detailed review and i hope you guys really enjoyed it so see you soon without liking, commenting, sharing, or subscribing. Share, subscribe, share, subscribe, share, subscribe.